I'm going to call him. Fucking asshole. Ah! <gasps> oh, what? He screamed my call. How do you always screen your call? I saw him on the binoculars. He screened the call. You know, I always thought people were doing that when I called them. This just confirms it. See, he taught me a lesson. I was going to give somebody the benefit of the doubt. I almost did. And then something said, no, don't. Don't. It's not for you. That's not my thing. That was a complete and utter waste oh, of time. what a waste of time. Why did we even stay the whole time? I don't even know. Oh, Sandy Goodman. Listen, just don't go nuts, all right? I know you want to say something, but don't. I'll don't talk do to you tomorrow. OK. Hey. Hey, Larry, I'm glad you made it. Yeah. Did you enjoy the game? Well, you told the head of NBC to go fuck himself? Yeah, I did. The guy says he's going to fix me up with taking, he puts me up in the rafters, the worst seats. Oh, I was so crazy. And then I caught the asshole screening my call. I'm, so you I'm, crap I'm, on the head of the network? What are you doing? He's apoplectic. Apoplectic, Larry. What I find interesting, in fact, fascinating, oh. is that you would go back to a restaurant where you and I had a meal for the sheer purpose of harassing a waiter for the most insignificant incident I'm sure that's ever happened in this man's life. We split a check, and, and he doesn't want to coordinate the tip. Why doesn't should I? Why, Why should I you? need to coordinate the you tip? You go with a friend, you tip in concert. Why are we in concert? There's no what? concert. No, two We're different people, concert. two different tips. A tip is a solo, Larry. No, it's Thank not. You. Yes, tip it is. Thank you. Thank you. Solo. If no. You... Tip is a solo. What is the big secret? He's got a big secret? What is the big You're secret? You're digging into my personal thing. I, what, you, 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 I gotta know what my taxes are. You wanna know what I paid for my no. house? I just think it's the right thing to do. That's it's, all. There's no right and wrong to it. In fact, you're wrong, and I'm right. Coma, fucking handicap, any of that shit. I don't think you fucking bring it. I, I'm telling you I brung it. I know when I bring it, and I know when I don't bring it, and I brought it. You did your fucking thing. Yes. You did a dizzle on her, right? I did what? The dizzle. The dizzle? You did, the, you did your dizzle on her, right? Yeah, I did my dizzle. That means you did yeah. your fucking thing, right? Whatever. Nobody fucking yes. Response, right? Yes. Bring the fucking ruckus to that ass, Larry. Oh, yeah. oh, why? You, I suppose you think you could have gotten a response? You goddamn right, Larry. Bullshit. I would have had her ass tap dance for Larry. No, don't. Here, take it. Take it. I don't want it. Take I don't it. pick up that pie. Put the pie down. I'm not taking a bite. I don't want a bite. Take this fucking piece of pie and get it out of my face. Put the fucking pie don't down. Don't put that pie down. Do not put that pie down. God damn it. You know something? I heard that Rosie O'Donnell beat the crap out of you. Oh, really? Yeah, that's, that's bullshit. What I heard. No, I ain't bullshit. Yeah, yeah, that's bullshit. Rosie beat the bullshit. crap out of you. Bullshit. You big sissy, yeah, you big she, fucking She's sissy. saying that? Is that what she said? Get this thing away from me. Thank you very much, Rosie O'Donnell. That's bullshit, by the way. She got me down. Yeah, okay, I admit that. She got me down. And I could have I could have reversed it, but it was stopped. People interfered. That's all. That's the only thing that happened. How dare you go around spreading that rumor? Why are you fighting women? She started it. By the but way. But doesn't mean you're not an asshole but, when it comes to checks at restaurants. Let me tell you something. That was my check, okay? I invited you. You were my guest. It was my pleasure. That is, that is bullshit. It, it was, was my, my pleasure. My pleasure. It was my, my pleasure. pleasure. And who no, no, no. listen, who got yeah. the bill? Yeah. I got the bill at the end. Bottom line, yeah. and you want to know something? You know what I'm doing next week? You know what I'm doing next yeah. week? I'm renting a yacht, and I'm calling all our friends, and we're taking a yacht to Catalina, and really? you're coming. Yeah. And I'm footing yeah. the whole freaking really? bill. You know what I'm doing? What are you doing? I'm calling your family. I'm flying them out here first class on a jet, putting them up in a hotel, taking them out to dinner. Really? really? Oh, yeah. really? Yeah. 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 How about this? Three? Hey, Norm, drop a ball. Ah! You've been looking for 20 minutes. Just drop a ball. I haven't been looking for 20 minutes. You can't hold up the whole course like this. Let us play through. You don't play through. Out of the question. It's not right. It's very inconsiderate. I'm not inconsiderate. You're inconsiderate. You're inconsiderate. No, You're you inconsiderate. Are. You want to do me a favor? Yeah, yeah. You what? shove it up your ass. Are you happy on the onions? Huh? You, you, you're I glad you had the onion? Let's go. Let's go. Don't get Let's angry go. at me just because we'll you're angry at me. No, we'll come back off. tomorrow. I come here to relax, to have a good time. Crispy onions, they have to be crispy. I can't eat breakfast unless I have crispy onions. How's your wife? Fuck you, Norm. I'm not a swan killer, OK? Hey, let me remind you of something, asshole. You're talking way too loud about swan killing in the dining room. Why is that so hard to understand? How many rules are you gonna break, okay? You're not supposed to have your phone on. It's always ringing. You killed a swan. Get your fucking you killed voice a down. Swan. Shut up! Shut up! The two of you better keep your goddamn trap shut about this swan. Or what, Larry? Are you threatening me? Yeah. What are you gonna do? What will you do to me, Larry? What, will what I can do? you do to me? I'll open that closet door, okay, and take every one of those hats and destroy them. The blue hat, 
the orange hat, the one with the cockle shells, the one with the feathers, and let's not forget the red one you're making for that asshole stonemason. You stop! stop. You will not touch those hats. I will destroy them. I will. You will not touch them. Keep your goddamn mouth shut. She will. She's not going to. Keep your mouth shut. Not going to ruin a hat. And you? How dare you say something? Mary, I'm not going to tell anybody. Don't worry. Well, how could I pay for the pants? If you lost my pants, that doesn't seem fair. I mean, first of all, we didn't lose them, they're gone. Oh, there's a difference between lost yes. and gone? Lost is different than they're gone. They're lost and they're gone. If they're lost, they'd be yeah. here in the lost and found. They're gone, and that's a difference. No, if they were lost, they wouldn't be there. They'd be lost, which they are. Okay, we have a sign in the fitting room that says that we're not responsible for any lost items. Oh, so we're good not for you. Yeah, I got a sign in my house, okay? It says, if somebody takes your pants, you take theirs. That's my sign. That's a stupid made-up sign. That doesn't exist. You're Nobody right. has a sign like that. Of course I don't have a sign like that. I just made it up for the purposes of this discussion. It's obvious I made it up. That's so obvious. I don't know what you believe. You might believe these things you say. So you might believe that I put up a sign in my bedroom that says, if you take my pants, I take yours? So it's not that unfathomable. Okay. You have to replace my pants. I'm not going to pay for these pants. No, because you're going to walk around with a security tag on that, and someone's going to arrest you or something. I, I don't, I don't it's like a scarlet out. letter. I'm happy to wear the scarlet letter. Call me Hester. Dennis, after a few glasses of wine, um, you know, Virginia went to the bathroom, and he asked me if I was interested in a menage a trois. I mean, I was, I mean, I was a little flattered. I just thought you'd find it funny. Funny? That's funny. That's funny? I don't find that funny at all. Who does he think he is? First of all, you're my ex-wife, okay? Okay. You're gonna have a menage with anybody. It's gonna be with me, not with him. Why would I wanna be in a menage with you? Well, you wouldn't, but if you're going to do it, I'd prefer that it would be with me, that's all. Okay. He was serious? <laughs> yeah, he was serious. Hey, Larry, what's up? You asked my wife to be in a threesome? Wife? Yes. You mean ex-wife? Whatever. No, whatever. There's a difference. No, there is Wife no has... difference. You don't need to concern yourself with the difference, okay? All right, fine. <sighs> yes, I asked your ex-wife if she would like to be in a threesome with my current wife. What is wrong What's with you? How could you, you do Larry? something like that? What's it to me? Yeah. Because I, I, I have feelings for her, and I don't need you to defile her, okay? <laughs> I would not be defiling her. You know, whatever two people do or three people do in the privacy of their own home is yeah, their I've own Yeah, I've heard that bullshit. Listen, she's not interested in doing anything in the privacy of your home, okay? Oh, really? Yeah, well, really. that remains to be seen. What does that mean? Larry, just because Cheryl is curious doesn't mean you have any right to get mad at me, okay? Chill out. Curious? Did you say curious? Do you respect wood, Susie? Uh, yes, I do respect wood. Why? You've demonstrated a consistent lack of respect for what is I say. Oh, I don't know what you're getting at. I don't know what this is about. I'll tell you what I'm getting at. I see a ring stain on your table. Yeah. I remember you standing over Julia's antique table with a drink. Yeah. Okay? There I'm putting two and two together. I think you left that ring stain on Julia's table. So don't tell me you respect wood. Oh, I respect wood, Larry. I respect wood so much that if I had a piece of wood in my hand right now, I'd beat the shit out of you with it, okay? Get the fuck out of here, all right? Okay. He took my $20. Are you kidding? He took your fucking money out your hand. You didn't say shit? What, did he think I was tipping him? Is he insane? <sighs> do you watch Wizards of Waverly Place? All right, that's it. That's it. No, I don't watch Wizards of Waverly Place.